Zion, you, you, uh, Duke takes on uh, Kentucky to open up the season next year. What's it like to be you know, on the big stage, Champions Classic against, you know, in, in such a big rivalry uh, like Kentucky? Obviously, you were recruited, recruited by Kentucky. What, what's that game going to be like for you? Um, that game is going to be like a very um, challenging game because, it's, you know, we're freshmen. Um, we're going in there with the expectations of if we don't get a national championship, then we're bust. Um, and if we lose, we have the expectations that if we lose, we're not good. If we don't win the national championship, we're not good. So going into this Kentucky game, it's going to be a, it's going to be a lot of expectations. But like I said, another reason I chose Duke because with Coach K's guidance and I feel like the time we'll have it do uh, with those that combination, I feel like. Uh, we really won't feel that pressure. What have you seen from Kelton and Tyler Hero this week? And then, obviously, you're, you're close with Emmanuel quickly. What uh, What are some of the things that you've seen from them uh, just over the course of your career? Um, Emmanuel, uh, I'm going to start with him. We came really close with him uh, this past summer with something called the Adidas Path. Um, him, and, him and Kelton shared this trait with the, being a dog. Like, no matter who they play against, um, no matter – what the scouting report says, they're going to go out there and they're not going to allow someone to like just bully them or just walk over them. They're always going to fight until the very end. Um, Tyler uh, is like probably the most underrated player in our class. Um, he's a very smooth and skilled scorer that I feel like he goes unnoticed for sometimes. Um, but yeah, I think with those three though, we have a chance to do something very special in Kentucky.